Furthermore, furthermore, you've got black parents moaning about the lack of black history being taught in schools. Blood. Why don't you fucking educate your child yourself? Why are you relying on someone else to educate your child on your own culture? You think Romanian parents moan about, oh, they don't teach Romanian history in school. I don't give a fuck. They will teach their children all they need to, yeah, Count Dracula, all them man there. Talk about the war with the Turks and that. You think Indian people moan about, oh, um, they don't teach anything about Indian history. No, because they got a pattern. Yeah, they might be from Sri Lanka or pa Pakistan or Bangladesh, whatever. But they're teaching their children them, yeah, this is what happened in the culture. Boom, bam, boom, whatever. Then, wh why are you relying on someone else to teach your children about your own culture? They could get the, they could get the information wrong or portray the information you know, incorrectly or in a negative way or something like that. So why don't you just trust yourself to educate your child? You 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 got time to be talking on Snapchat and gossiping with your friends, talking about entanglement and what business and that or what happened in love and hip hop. But you ain't you ain't got time to educate your children about your own blasted history. But then you go and complain about it. It's foolishness. You think you, you I'm going to be worried about my, um, the teachers them teaching my child about J Jamaican history or, or, or whatever. If I was that worried about it, I'll just teach them myself. And in the process, I'll be learning stuff. No one knows everything about their history. All these people, oh, I'm so pro-black, I'm so educated, rare tear. So you're so educated and that. Why don't you pass down the knowledge to your child? You're so well-read. Because there's certain people out here, they're so pro-black, it's like they got a fucking PhD in this shit. They could tell you everything about black history, but then their picnic them don't know nothing. Oh, for you people that's not Jamaican, uh, picnic them is, uh, is, is, is a child, is a kid. Yeah. You're so well read on yeah, all this yeah, history, black history, or oh, racism, slavery and that, but you... But you're not teaching your child. You, why, why, why are you relying on someone else that you don't know to teach your child about your own culture's history? What if they get the facts wrong? Yeah, yeah, I get it. It might be a bit boring in schools to keep hearing about Henry VIII and his X amount of wives and 1066 Battle of Hastings and that. Yeah, maybe they need to teach... See, this, I, I don't business about black history because, I, as I said before, you know, it's down to the parents. They should just teach world history. Yeah, we all know about the Russians and the Germans, Hitler and Count Dracula. See, you know, before you talking about Count Dracula, that's fiction. No, no, Count Dracula is not a fictitious person. That was a real man. The real man. I never knew that it was a real person called Count Dracula. I thought he was a fictitious fucking vampire. Even furthermore, even Transylvania. I thought that was the fictitious home of Dracula. I didn't even know that there was a place called Transylvania. It's based in Romania. It's a real place. Now, obviously, um, there was obviously I don't believe in the supernatural anyway, so I don't believe in no god or nothing. Yeah, no supernatural. Obviously, you weren't a vampire, but I think you used to cut people's heads off and or drink their blood or something like that. And then, yeah, but shit like that. Stuff like that. They need to be teaching world history. Yeah, I want to know what, you know, I want to know about um, the communism in, in the eastern parts of Europe as well. Interesting. Interesting. The Turks. All you lot think Turk, the word Turk means kebab man and shish. No, the real Turks them, but they don't even look like the, the Turkish people that you think you know now. They're not the indigenous Turkish people. They're not the indigenous Turks. You know what the real Turks look like? The real Turks look like people from Mongolia and China. That's what the real Turks look like. Yeah, Northern Central Asia. Tajikistan, Turkmenistan, Kazakhstan. That's where the real Turks are from, around them regions there. But you lot didn't know that. And it don't matter. It don't make you stupid if you don't know that. But what I'm saying is, they need to teach world history. Just little dumb stuff like that. Like, you know, 
need to teach stuff about human migration. Stop moaning about, oh, they're not teaching black history. But the kids probably don't, the, the kids probably don't care about black history like that. They'd rather go on Instagram. They'd rather play fucking Fortnite. They'd rather snap. Or they'd rather film fucking altercations with the police and black people. Everything but educate themselves about black history. Don't be moaning about the, the, the pitney them ain't, ain't learning black history. If they really wanted to learn, they would. Everyone's got time to go on the internet and, and watch videos about stuff that they don't need to be watching. Porn. How many of you black men watching this right now? When you was 15. You could have had 100 tabs open about black history. Because obviously they don't teach it in school. But instead you had 100 tabs. Spank wire. Red tube. All the, yeah. You know the ones man. Don't. You know. Just not playing no games now. Isn't it? So let's, let's not complain about. Uh. The, the, the people them in schools not teaching uh, the pity them about black history when you can find time you can find time you know, you you watching all these videos about trading and shit like that yeah because you want yeah quick fix watching all these twerking videos you got time to be watching them man they during lockdown with their twerking shows you got time to be watching uh blue face with his them 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 crazy gal in the yard and uh, you got time to watching that but you, you ain't got time to be watching black history and then the parents are gonna complain about the pity them not 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 being educated in school. Come on man. School's not gonna teach you everything. In school, yeah, they should teach stuff like, you know, how to manage money and that. Really and truly it should be the parents that are teaching their children. But again, some of these parents can't, can never teach their children about how to manage money. Why? Because they're wearing Balenciaga. Because they're in debt. They'd rather drive a Mercedes than put that money towards private tuition. Or private tutor for their child who's struggling at maths, English and or science. Anyway. Been on this thing long enough. So I don't want no moaning about them not teaching black history in school. Educate yourself. These are not four-year-olds that need to be spoon-fed everything. you got their internet. You can find out things for yourself. You're that interested about your own culture. How difficult is it to watch a 10-minute video every day? On your journey to, yeah, it's not like you have to stop what you're doing. On your way to school, on the bus, 10 minute video about black history. Millions of videos on YouTube. Oh, ain't no fucking complaining. Stay wise.